Well, it suddenly seems a lot like Christmas. It's the Roland Merrick Handicap Chase. This is run on Boxing Day. So we know we've got the big Christmas meetings going up next week. This one has just been tagged on the end of this week, I think. Anyway, it's a three-mile, one furlong, 0-110 to handicap. And Poles Hayes at the top for James Shea. Sapphire and Steel, Martellino, Mozart, Largo, Vinnie Gerard, Danzig, Caramel, Thomas Rogers, Hello Bud, Obi-Wan, Timoka, Shu for James Shea. It's a... I should have got a stew to be contact on this. He would have jangled his jingle bells for you like he did many years ago. And away they go. With Paul's Hay on the inside, just about the first to show being joined though by Sapphire and Steel. Here comes Timoka Shoe. Hello, Bud on the inside. So, into the first of 22 fences. They've got a lot of fences to jump in this three mile up. I think not one foot on, isn't it? But it's still a lot of fences to be negotiated. They get over the second, which is a ditch, and if they were to all get round. Only one would fail to take Christmas money home. Paul's Hay leads into the third. Mistake at the back by Hello Bud, who at the moment is looking like the favourite to go home potless. But it's Paul's Hay in the lead getting to number four. From Danzig Caramel second. And Ozark Logo is third as they come up past the big screen. And past the winning post. And they'll swing out two more circuits of the track to go. And the Assembled race guys, slightly confused as somebody tells him it's not Christmas till next week. And Paul's Hayes in front from Ozark Largo second, Danzig Caramel third, Sapphire and Steel fourth. Here comes Timoka Shoe, and finally Hello Bud at the back. They're quite well strung out, and a predominantly green field as well. We're just Sapphire and Steel in the maroon and yellow as they get over the fifth. And Hello Bud at the back in the yellow without any green. All of those are predominantly green. And over that ditch they go. Paul's Hay leads by a good four or five lengths. To Ozark Largo second as they take the seventh. Good jump there by Sapphire and Steel. I've seen that one moving to third, jumping past Danzig Caramel. And Timoka shoot, and finally, hello, bud. It's a short run to the next. And the order is pretty much as you were as they race into the final two miles and skip over this ditch. Which they all got over nicely. Poles Hay, four clear of Ozark Largo, second. Sapphire still third on the outside of Timoka shoot, and then Danzig Caramel, and finally, hello, bud at the back. For Obi Wan, oh, I'm pretty sure he's our lone American entrant this year, which is probably quite disappointing. Really, we need to get a few more people from over the over the pond involved. There used to be quite a lot at one point, I'm sure. But they seem to have all fallen by the wayside, but it's Poles Hay in the lead from Ozark Largo in second. As we get to the tenth, and Sapphire and Steel was over in fourth a little bit untidily. Danzig Caramel after that one, and Hello Bud still just the back marker as they get to the next ditch, which is the 11th, and that's the midway point in the jumping. And they're all still on their feet. All six of them going well. Been one or two untidy jumps, but nothing too serious as they get to the next. Oh, and as I say, that Sapphire and Steel has crashed out, so the commentators curse, and nobody can curse the commentator more than the commentator himself because the commentator's horse was the one that fell. So it's Paul's Hay in the lead then. From Ozark Largo in second. Timoka Shoes in third. And Danzig Caramel fourth. And Hello Bud in fifth. So it's the commentator that's going home potless. And Paul's Hay that's in the lead. From Ozark Largo in second. Timoka Shoe third. And then Danzig Caramel and Hello Bud. As they make their way down towards the next. Paul's Hay in front. Tim Ozark Largo. Tim Okushu, Danzig Caramel. Hello, Bud. Hello, Bud. Just getting a little bit closer at the back. As they take number 14, and a mistake this time was by Tim Okushu. Still got the best part of a mile to race, and quite a lot of jumping to do as they get over the 15th of the 22. 
Now, Poles Hay has been in the league pretty much all the way from Ozark Largo second. Over the 16th they go and Ozark Largo made a mistake now and Hello Bud is the one creeping into it on the outside moving into second as they take fence number 17. And Poles Hay, Ozark Largo, Hello Bud, Danzig Caramel and then Tomoka Shoot. They're all pretty close. Oh and the leader's gone! Poles Hay's been in the lead all the way and he just took a lunge at that one and the jockey had no chance. And that's left us with just four. And it's Ozark Largo on the inside of Hello Bud. Between the two of them is Danzig Caramel. Behind those is Tomoka Shoe. And all four of these have still got a live chance in this. They've got four furlongs to race. And they've got four more fences to take. And Hello Bud in the yellow jacket just about in the lead now. But Danzig Caramel starts to move forward. Danzig Caramel, that one's been around for a season or so, I think. But now being immediately pressed again by Ozark Largo on the inside. And Hello Bud on the outside. Tomoka Shoe just caught a bit flat footed as they get to the fourth last. Over that one they go. And it's Ozark Largo on the inside of Danzig Caramel. Hello Bud back in third. Gap back to Tomoka Shoe fourth. This is the final ditch, the third from home. And there's nothing between the leaders. It's Ozark Largo on the inside and can Danzig Caramel on the far side chasing them in third is Hello Bud they get over the second last and now Ozark Largo starts to assert Ozark Largo Danzig Caramel though responds immediately here's the final fence over in they go and they land almost together it's Ozark Largo on the inside Danzig Caramel on the outside Ozark Largo looks just as stronger and at the post Ozark Largo takes it Danzig Caramel is second Hello Bud is third and Tomoka Shoe is fourth uh, they were the only four that finished with Poles Hay and Sapphire and Steel crashing out earlier in the race but it's the winner for Vinnie Gerard Ozark Largo Danzig Caramel second for Thomas Rogers I think and Obi won third with Hello Bud and James Shade probably fourth let's take a look at it it's Ozark Largo Vinnie Gerard the winner Danzig Caramel Thomas Rogers second Hello Bud Obi won third Tomoka Shoe James Shade fourth and they were the only four that finished.